In our previous video, we have learned how to get parameters value from the route using activated route. In this video, we will learn one more concept to get the parameters value from the route. Let's see how we can do that. Here, we are using the same application that we have created in this video series. This time, we will use this user module. Here, we have user routing module. Here, we are passing the parameter in the parent level. Uh, we are having these two children component. Now, I want to get this user ID for both these component. Now, let's start with delete book component. Here, I want to write the code. Let's open this delete book component. Here, uh, let's copy the code from book details component. Here, copy this code from constructor and paste it in the delete book component constructor and let's copy the code from ng horn init method and paste it in the delete book component remove these codes that we don't need and add the necessary imports okay now let's create one property user id type string and then assign some null value okay I want to get this value from params so this dot user id equal to param u square bracket and then in single quote user id that's it now let's print the value in html template so in html file using p tag user id using interpolation we can display the user id here user id okay save the changes the application is running in the browser let's open the browser here let's update the url user and then id let's say 2 and then delete book delete book then press enter see here we are not having the user id here in delete book component uh, we have written the entire code properly but we are not getting the user id now let's print the value in console then we will see what we have inside this console.log save the changes go back to the browser see here we have an empty object we do not have anything inside this param this same code was working in book details component but it is not working here now let's understand the concept let's open this uh, public routing module uh, we are passing two parameters in the same route but in user routing module um, we are passing this user id in the parent level so there is a difference in between these routes so we have to use parent to work with these type of routes okay in delete book component now we have to use parent in this route here we are getting an error because its value is null let's use question mark here and save the changes go back to the browser see here now we got user id here and we got the same user id in the html template also it is working now now if you have defined your routes where parameters are available in the root level then after this route uh, we have to use parent remaining are same concept now let's understand the same concept in child component now in public routing module see here we are passing the id and author id in this url now i want to get this data in public component so in this constructor we have to use activated route so let's use private and then route use activated route in ng on init method this dot route dot params 
then we need to use subscribe method your type will be param then your console dot log dot param sorry bracket let's write param and save the changes your yeah. go back to the browser if i click on this book details app uh, these are coming from book details component see here uh, we got a blank object here it means uh, if i want to access child parameters from parent component then this concept will not work then go back to vs code editor to get the data from the child route um, to the parent component we have to use this uh, first child here we are getting error because uh, its value is null use question mark because this object is possibly null okay save the changes let's see in the browser reload this page see here we are getting an id and author id using this approach we can get the value from the child route this is how we can get the parameter value in parent and child component okay uh, if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more videos thanks for watching this